Hey y'all, prepare yourselves. Gonna drop some knowledge. By the way, my name's Isaiah. So gravity, what is gravity? Has anybody ever actually gone out of their way to figure out what gravity is? Because I don't think you understand the gravity of the situation. Gravity is this invisible force, it's all around us, and it causes objects to be attracted to one another. Remember that, gravity, it's attractive. If we didn't have gravity, your feet wouldn't be able to stay on the ground. And gravity is actually what pulls cups off of the edges of tables. <whistles> gravity is also weaker with distance. So the further away you move from the planet, the weaker gravity gets. Gravity is weaker with distance. The farther you move away, the less you can pull that weight. Gravity actually spreads out indefinitely. But, because you're so far away from the Earth, it can't pull on you as much. Near the surface of the Earth, gravity is strong. Dun, dun, dun. <laughs> more mass equals more gravity! Even you have gravity! You get gravity! You get gravity! Everybody gets gravity! Everything has gravity, even you, right? So you are pulling the Earth towards yourself the same time that the Earth is pulling you towards it. But the difference is, you weigh maybe 1.4 e to the second power pounds, and Earth weighs 1.3 e to the 25th. It weighs a lot! It's so massive, it doesn't even feel how much you're pulling on it at all. <sighs> But wait, there's more. Order now and get two and a half times more weight on Jupiter. Still not enough? Order in the next five minutes and get 28 times more weight on the sun. Weight is a measure of the pull that gravity has on you. So the more mass an object has, the more pull it has on it, right? But it also affects how much gravity is pulling on you. So if you go to the moon, since it's smaller, it has less mass, it pulls on you a lot less, so you weigh less on the moon. We all like the moon. Yeah, science! Essentially, think of gravity as a universal strength. Without the sun's gravity to keep the Earth in orbit, the Earth would just travel through space in a straight line. So you can imagine all these tiny little gravitational strings stretching out from the sun and attaching themselves to all the planets. And it keeps the planets in orbit around the sun on this plane. But you might be asking yourself, why aren't the planets being attracted towards the sun? That is because of inertia. Which we need more time for. Yo, do we have like three more minutes? Can I just, can I, 